Hey guys, welcome back to the 9 for 9 podcast. I'm your host, Jason Kim. Yes, sir. Joined with my brother, Paul Lee. What's good, baby? And then on my left, we got Megan Yu. Hello. And then on my right, we got Jennifer Lee. Hi, everyone. What's going on? Welcome yeah. back. Welcome back. What's going welcome on? back to the <laughs> show. Hey, first, I just wanted to say thank you for showing love on Jennifer's episode. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. Yes, right. sir. She really did a good job in opening up. Yeah. I read all the comments. I know. Mm. They were so sweet. Yeah, yeah. They were. Yeah. She was a little nervous before. She's like, ah. I was. I was yeah. a little nervy. But the comments, I love you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Finger heart's insane, bro. Also, I want to uh, I want to ask you guys if you're fucking with like the picture thumbnails better, or if you like the, the original ones. Yeah, the yeah, original, yeah, yeah, yeah. just like a uh, color background with us. Yeah, I yeah. look you like the OG one. I like really? The OG yeah. ones. Drop a comment. Let us know though. Maybe okay, we can, okay. like switch it up a little bit. Yeah, okay, yeah, okay, yeah. okay, I'm okay, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, <laughs> for sure. Yeah. Um, what's going on with you, the Megan? I have. 10 mosquito bites. What? <laughs> From what? I was playing die after class because I was like trying to like pass time. Uh-huh. And literally it was like 45 minutes of us playing and I have 10 mosquito bites on my legs. No Too juicy. Way. You're, you're a dude, bro. Yeah, yeah, playing <laughs> die? Playing die? No, everyone plays die. Oh, just, no, I know, I know. Just toss it after my class real quick. Yeah, <laughs> no, like have you guys ever played? Yes, of course. Of course, bro, of course it's so fun. It's hella fun. Yeah. You guys, honestly, my my tosses are pretty nice. I just have no hands. Like, we can run that any time, Megan. Wait, are you actually serious? Any time. Any time. Okay. We used to play every summer. Bro, <gasps> any time. Me too. Homemade table. <laughs> can we make a nine for nine table? <laughs> I'll paint it. I'll paint it. I'll paint it. Okay, anyways. If you could convince her to play. <laughs> oh my God, Wait, I don't it's even fun. know what that is. She, she don't. She not. It's fuck, like the she dice, fuck and then that. on the table, and you have to like throw it, and you have it's to. It's a whole it. sport. It's a whole sport Dude, for real, though. I'm a lady. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is that where you like throw money and shit? No, no, no. no you throwing okay. dice. You throwing <laughs> dice. <laughs> no, like there's like money on the ground. And, oh, no, throwing that's dice. dice. Oh, yeah. That's yeah. throwing dice. Oh, die wait. is like yeah. what's die? You're tossing dice. You ever like, seen that where like like a bu- it's like popular like at SB? It's l- really popular. You like in SB. run up, toss, die. Yeah, yeah. And it's a long like, ass <laughs> table. There's like four like cups. On yeah, okay, she don't know. She yeah, don't, she don't know. know. If she don't know this, then she don't know. <laughs> <laughs> For real. Yeah. The iconic. Yeah, yeah. But this episode is going out after Slander. Mm-hmm. Oh, but yeah. we're but we're recording it before Slander. Right. So I just want to say if we met yeah, you Thank know. You I hope you had a good ass time. For real, for real. We are really excited to go. Yeah, I'm excited. Saturday. Yeah. Saturday. It's literally. just me and Jason. They didn't want to I mean Jennifer's not gonna be here. Yeah. Right. Yeah, you don't want to yeah, show yeah, yeah, yeah. You know me, man. But yeah. no, what I was gonna say, dude, you guys are actually gonna run into so many people, bro. Hopefully, like, hopefully, bro. Hopefully, hopefully. Yeah. I'm actually very curious. Like after, if it was anything like chain smokers, uh-huh. like yeah, that would be. A- it was pretty crazy. Actually. Yeah. Our, if you guys aren't in our Discord, you guys should join, by the way. But our Discord was going crazy. What like, a mean? bunch of people are asking, like, yo, I'm driving down for slander. Some kid was like, I'm doing this for the first yeah. time. I need some tips. <laughs> oh, it was so oh, funny, was bro. Wait, I, need, I need to check it out. With the yeah, like, bro. Advice and stuff. No, slander meetup? Oh, no, it's going out after. Yeah, it's going, it's going no, you, That's why you got to join the Discord, and you can <laughs> let them know. That's we'll why. be there, like, earlier, like, 5.30. <laughs> I don't even know what time it starts, but... We are going to go to 5.30. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Well, my, I wanted to say uh-huh. my girl's finally coming back from Asia uh-huh. <laughs> tomorrow after a month. You excited? Very excited. <laughs> Very excited. <laughs> Your Jason, hand is tired. Huh? <laughs> I know. I know. <laughs> she, that's oh, exactly yeah. what I was about to say. <laughs> Yo, that's out of You waited to release some, some, man. I know you, bro. I know this oh guy, man. Out of pocket, Dude, this guy is dog. Arthritis in your hand. Yo, if you guys see Jason with this girl just macking on each other at slander, just please turn away. Mind please turn no, away. No, take a video, take a video, take a video, <laughs> and send it in the Discord. Trip it past. Trip it <laughs> nah, it was a uh, it was a very lonely month. I, it's I okay, bro. I can't lie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but we're gonna pick you up tomorrow. Okay. Yeah, we about to go to slander together too. Dude, you're gonna have a good time, bro. Tight yeah. shit, tight shit. You're going to have a great time, man. Yeah. Anything going on with you, Jennifer? I'm out of town. Thugging with my round. <laughs> oh. <laughs> my booty hole. My booty Both hole. Both in sync. Booty hole. Damn. Damn. Uh, I will be out of town this weekend, so don't hit me up. <laughs> don't hit me up. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yeah, I'm going to Colorado with my roommate. Oh, yeah, type that's shit. That's crazy. What, what was that delay? Like, <laughs> I, I was swallowing my you know, spit real quick. Oh, okay. You know, we don't really go out to those kind of states, but you know, <laughs> it's cool. <laughs> it's cool. It's no, cool. Denver okay. is, is really pretty. Wait, you've been there before? I've been, I went for skiing. Oh, it must be great for skiing, right? <laughs> <laughs> I know it snows a lot in Colorado. That's all I know. It's the summertime, so yeah, I'm going to yeah, be yeah. there. Um, if I run into you, then say what's up, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I don't know if you go to Reddit to people. <laughs> no, there might be, bro. There might be. There's a, some Spotify event going on right now. You see that? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, yeah, in Colorado. Wait, is it through this weekend? It might be. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. Uh, uh, we'll see. <laughs> <laughs> She's not popping out to that, though. Uh, who knows? 949 represent. <laughs> <laughs> Paul, what about you? What do you do? Uh, do nothing, dude. I'm just, uh, right now, I'm getting used to the nine to five grind. Yeah. Ah, like, I'm yeah. really living that nine to five right now. It's hard, huh? Dude, it's so, like, r- repetitive, bro. I don't know it how is, people yeah. do it for their whole life, bro. Yeah. Like, dead ass. Mm-hmm. But, it's yeah, hard. That's, that's about it for me. Yeah. Also, we're doing the Nerf gun challenge today, too. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's a funny ass one. Yeah, you guys got to stick around. Stay, stay to the end. We already filmed it, too. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. You guys owe, us, owe me a shot. <laughs> huh? Oh, we uh, already that shot. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, that was pretty much all of our weeks. Mm-hmm. Uh, we can just get it to the, in today's episode. Mm-hmm. Now, this week, we got a bunch of uh, random questions. Um, Jennifer prepared a lot. Megan prepared a lot. So, you guys want to start, actually? I'll the go first. Yeah, yeah. I, need, I need the Yeah, I got you. I got you. Yep, yep. Yeah, you can start with I'll your start. question, though, and then, yeah. I'm going to read your messages. No, what the <laughs> fuck? I'm kidding. <laughs> okay. I have a question. When you and your ex break up, uh-huh. do you guys throw everything away? Ooh. <laughs> That's a good question. That is a good question. Yeah. Oh, uh, like, well, I've never experienced that, keep, so let you guys answer, bro. You throw away. Nah, nah, we're not throwing everything away. <laughs> <laughs> we're not throwing everything away. Wait, then what do you keep and what do you throw away? Or like, I like, I kept everything, uh-huh. actually. There wasn't really much to keep, <laughs> TBH. Uh-huh. But I, <laughs> 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 uh-huh. <laughs> but I also put all our photos in an album and threw, threw that away. I threw all her photos oh. away, and I threw, and I also deleted all her messages. Really? Mm-hmm. Oh, what messages the is crazy. I kind of just let it sit. We didn't really have a lot of messages either. So <laughs> 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 really oh. like. Yo. But I just also pictures. I feel like. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's I mean? a big one. Oh, she I threw them away. No, I, I I deleted them. Oh okay okay. <laughs> I was gonna say I I kept all of the birthday handwritten letters. Oh. Mm. You gotta keep those. Yeah, I, I kept those. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta keep those. Those are yeah. Yeah, yeah, and uh, the pictures. A lot of the like the you know the photo booth pictures oh. that come out like at the fourth. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Just kept those. <laughs> kept those. <laughs> <laughs> the question is, Jason, where do you keep those now? Uh, they just you know they're hidden away. Right you know? under your pillow it's, and it, shit. It says, <laughs> <laughs> it, says oh, it says like OC Fair 2018. <laughs> oh, no, I know what photo it is too. Oh my god. You know. Fuck. Oh okay. I just got a, I just got a new one. OC Fair 2023. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hell no. That's cute, though. That's cute, bro. Honestly. Yeah, 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 yeah. I would keep those, too. Yeah. <laughs> um, I keep everything, but I keep it in, like, a separate place. Yeah. Yeah. Girls but have, like, a box. Of oh, I feel like. really? Mm-hmm. We have I a don't question. delete the photos or anything and the messages. I don't really care. I have a real quick mm-hmm. question for you guys regarding that. If you see the shit, like, your ex got you, do mm-hmm. you kind of think about her? Or is it at that point, it's just a, it's just a material? No, I don't even think about it anymore. It's just a yeah. material. Yeah, really? really just yeah material. don't take it the wrong way. Uh-huh. We're not keeping it because we have feelings. Right, right, right. It's just like a, it was a piece of our history that we kind of just don't want to throw away. Right, exactly. right, right. Because yeah. I feel like we'll forget it once we throw it away. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. But it's not like I'm going to, I'm opening that box and looking, like at, looking at it every at night. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. That's exactly. OD. That's yeah. OD. Yeah, 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 yeah. Actually, I had this one flower bear. Uh-huh. Tossed it. Flower bear? Those <laughs> are expensive, bro. I don't give a fuck. Yeah. No. Anyways, I have a second question. <laughs> okay. Um, how should a girl know they're getting played? Ooh. <laughs> okay. Well, I have what one. What are that's some signs? Okay, right off the bat, I'd say if they're on do not disturb on your date, that's weird. Ooh. Because then Ooh, why are they hiding one. their notifications? Like, because I know some guy homies who do that. Facts. Or facts. like. <sighs> Dude, I don't know if they're. I feel like first date if they're also like on their phone a lot. Mm. I th- I feel mm-hmm. that that's pretty sus. Yeah. Mm. Oh, is this like a? First those are more date like those are more like red flags though. Right. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I think yeah. what she means more is if like, like he's you've only been talking, yeah. if he's only hitting her up right at night. Yeah, oh. that's more what I was going for. Yeah, if oh, he's only oh, hitting her up at night, then it's she's kind of like the side thing. Oh yeah, for she sure. She getting played. Right. But um, I feel like a girl, yeah. you gotta know that at this point, bro. If you're only getting hit up at two a.m. Yeah, or like if if he's asking you to hang out, uh-huh. but he's not actually going. You're not. You guys aren't actually going on a date. Right, right. It's like right. a quick, like you know, like a fast food. And yeah, then yeah, yeah. To the crib. Okay. Oh. You know. Well, then I going. Uh, oh. Oh, I have another one. Uh-huh. One is like you always have to go to him, not the other way around. 
Yeah. Mm. Oh, that? That's okay. A yeah. That's a good yeah. one. That's a good one. Another thing we talked about this, like how he acts like after the deed. Oh, yeah. You know That's I mean? huge, like too. If he's laying oh. next to you or if he's just like leaving the room for a second. Right. You know? Mm. Also, if you guys are like not really talking a lot, he's taking a long time to respond. Yeah. Oh. You know? If my man's is busy, uh-huh. yeah, you get him played. But then what if there's the natural busy guys like you, you know, just late texters? Uh... <laughs> I feel You're like not a bad guy, Jason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's. I feel like you could tell though the difference between you like could, yeah. No, it's could, whether they're could. willing to like keep the conversation going or not. Facts, you know? facts, facts. Yeah. Or if you're like asking to hang out like during the day and he keeps saying he's busy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, you know. Uh-huh. But then he hits you up every once in a while at night. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's a huge sign right yeah. there, bro. Mm-hmm. Do you guys think that right person, wrong time is a real thing? <sighs> <sighs> right person, wrong time. It. Yeah. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Because let's say like you just got a job or or like you don't have enough money, mm-hmm. you know? Or like you're like going through some personal shit. It would be more like that. Vibe. Dude, but wouldn't the right person make it the right time? You don't no. think so? <laughs> I mean, no, here we, here we go with the wordplay. Like, <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Here we go like again with the wordplay. You know oh my god. <laughs> it could be on like your end. You know, maybe I'm right I'm think of it like this. I'm trying to think of your exes. Mm-hmm. If you were to date them today instead of like two years ago, right. would it have worked? Right, right, right. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. that's what I'm getting at. Yeah. No, they're your ex for a reason. Right. Yeah, yeah. In exactly. that sense, in that sense, you're an, it's an ex for a reason. Yeah. Yeah. But I think there are other factors, like a lot of college relationships. Like if they're not from the same area, bro, and they yeah. break up because of that, mm-hmm. yeah. it's like, dude, they really could have worked out if they were in the same city. Like long that distance, is true. that is true. Long yeah, distance, that or like if they up. got a job in New York, but you're not, but you're gonna go to New York in two years. Yeah, then yeah. it would work mm-hmm. in two years, but right. not now. Facts. I facts, guess. Facts. I guess. Yeah. Yeah. But only those situations, I'd say. Yeah. Besides that, probably not. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but I kind of feel you. Like the right person, like you will make it the right time. Yeah. Right. Like, there's no you way you're really gonna find the perfect person, and just because like some sort of like you know one yeah. little problem, right. and it's the wrong time now. Exactly. That is true. That is true. And I feel like that is how the universe works. Like everyone is coming into your life at the right time, uh-huh. or like at a specific time for a reason. Yeah. Oh, so you think right? you're like meant I agree. to meet yeah. people no, I at agree. this time in your life? Yeah. You're meant to meet people at certain points of your life yeah, really? and they mm-hmm. all have a like, purpose in your life mm-hmm. that you don't yet see. Mm. But I think we try to hold on to that like right person, wrong time because we don't like want to let them go. Yeah, but they've yeah, yeah, already sure. served their purpose. Yeah. No, so sure. I have I have a thing for this. Oh. It's like you meet three people in your like three different types of people in your life. Yeah. When they walk into your life, the first one is gonna be somebody that you're gonna learn a lesson from. Like, they're, like, the wrong person, wrong. Like, you're learning off of them. Like, it's mm-hmm. a bad person. And then the second person is somebody that is a reflection of yourself mm-hmm. to, like, see, like, what you need to improve on maybe for the future. And then third person is, like, the right one. Mm. I mean, that makes sense. I believe, yeah, I believe that. <laughs> I love more than three people, though. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm, I'm not saying, like, it's you're just the three people, different types of people. People will fall into oh. those yeah, categories. Yeah, yeah, yeah. People yeah. fall yeah. into those categories. No, 100%. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. oh, that makes a lot of sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, no, I agree because the right person does come at the right time, but you think it's the wrong time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Like in your, I see what you're saying. In your example, your ex came into your life at that time so that he could teach you your, lesson. those lessons. Yeah, yeah. Mm. But you might have thought, oh, it's the wrong time or something. I'm not saying you did, yeah, but yeah, I'm yeah, saying but some I'm people are like, oh, it's the wrong time. Exactly, yeah, mm. yeah. But, yeah. But I learned a lesson off of him, you know? Yeah. Okay, okay. Everyone's spitting today for some reason. <laughs> yeah. what the hell? It's making too much sense. Okay. <laughs> 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 I was like, where'd you get that three types from? I know. I was I'm like, like, where did like you I, know, I feel like I know this. This is like a thing people know. Amazing. We girls talk about it. Yeah. Wait, okay. also, do you guys think that when you meet a girl for the first time, you mm-hmm. know if you want to cuff her? Oh, yeah. Because have you guys heard like of right like the, the box bat? rule? No. What is that? The like when a guy rule. first meets you, they put you into a box. Cuff or just like play around with mm-hmm. or just like, you know, for mm-hmm. fun. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. So oh, yeah. Do you categorize these girls right away? And can you enter the relationship box if you were put into the other, other box, box first? Other box first? Oh, so is it like friends, like fool around with and then cuff? Yeah. So and let's say like you uh, met this girl, but she is fitting the fool around box. Yeah. 
can she eventually get to the relationship box? Yep. Absolutely, exactly. absolutely. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 I don't agree. I don't agree. Really? I don't. If, if I put you in the friend box, you're not going nowhere. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah you're yeah, not going yeah, nowhere. Yeah, yeah. But if I put you in the fool around box, yeah. Yeah, I can, you can move up to the relationship. You could, but yeah. dude, that shit's not work. Or for me personally, that shit don't work, bro. Yeah. Really? I don't know. Like, I find it that when I first see a girl, yeah. and genuinely, I think, like, sexual thoughts, yeah. like, it's always kind of, like, on that vibe, the whole relationship. Like, it doesn't get too, too serious. It's, I feel but like, why does that mean you can't date her? That means like, you like, find her physically attractive, right, right. though. I know, I but, like, personality-wise. I think it's only oh. that. It's a physical attraction. Yeah, but yeah, that yeah. personality develops later, no? It does, it does. But, I don't, like, I just don't. don't think it should start out, like, in that way. Really? I don't know. That's, that's my opinion. I mean, I think I think you can move around. Move around? Yeah. Between the friends to the relationship, too? Yeah. Mm, actually, yeah. For girls, like, guys yeah, grow girls, on them. Yeah, yeah, yeah they yeah. grow. They yeah. grow. Girls is very different, because yeah, girls yeah. get to know, know you somebody better yeah. and, uh-huh. and like you more. I, like, so realize, like, even if you're a girl, uh-huh. and I think, like, and I think... Like, I don't know you. I think you're, like, whatever. But mm-hmm. then as I get to know you more, like, as a friend, I think you become really pretty, like, looks-wise as well. Oh, really? Even yeah. with your friends? Even with my girlfriends, yeah. Oh, wow. Because I know them as a person. Right, 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 right. <laughs> I was going to say for us, though, yeah. low-key as guys, yeah. the friends and fuck-around lane gets kind of blurred because sometimes you want to fuck around with them, but <laughs> it, just, it just doesn't work. You just turn into the friend. <laughs> so sometimes it just don't also work, Also, for a guy, like, the friend to a relationship will never happen. No, like, but the thing is, you still label them as the fool around box first. Right, right, right. So, like, it's like they're ending up in the friends because they don't want to get with you. Yeah. Is that But, but that doesn't mean, like, but they ended up in the fool around box first. Yeah. 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 <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. No, to guys, like. I feel like it's more, more box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's more important. It is, it is. It's more important. It's pretty accurate. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty accurate as a guy. Like, yeah. when I see a girl, like, kind of on the first 10 seconds for real, I'm like, Okay, yeah, this is definitely a friend. <laughs> or this is, okay, maybe this is a relationship, but for sure yeah. a fuck around. Yeah. You know what I mean? But I'm saying she could move up from the fuck around yeah, to no, the. No, she could. Yeah. She could. She yeah. Could. yeah. Mm. It's just not working out when I did that, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it's because you set the bar a little too low, even maybe. for the fuck arounds. Maybe you're right. Maybe yeah. you're right. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it, could be, it could be that. Could you be know? That. Yeah. Yeah. Because if you hit like fives and. You know? No, okay, yeah. okay, yo, yeah. chill, bro, yeah. chill, bro. You told me, you told me you never hit a five. I no, I hit a five. That's what I'm saying. But the majority, <laughs> don't, they're like eight and up. But I'm saying, if you accept to hit a five, yeah, obviously she's not gonna move up. <sighs> yeah, no, no. But if your sure. fuck arounds are still sevens, right? But it's not about that for the moving up for me. It's not the looks that's making like the looks is enough for me to hit. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So it's the Paul, personality Paul that makes it move up. Yeah. So it don't really matter. Like the looks is like I'm d- I'm okay with the looks either way. You saying you would date a five? No, but it was a five for you. It wasn't a five for me. <laughs> <laughs> That's the thing. That's the thing. Exactly. That's the thing. Period. You feel me? <laughs> yeah, you feel me. Like, yeah. yeah. You feel me. All right. All right. All right. All right. Yeah. All right, all right, all right. It makes sense. <laughs> okay. Well, I have another scenario for you guys. Okay. If there was your dream girl or dream guy, <laughs> uh-huh. but they don't sacrifice that much for you versus someone who's not really your dream type, but they sacrifice a lot. Which one are you going with? Ooh. Dude, I, I've always <laughs> gone with the dream, don't sacrifice. Really? Yeah. And it never works out. It never right? works out. Dude, yeah, that leads to the heartbreak, though. Mm-hmm. No, exactly. Because they fit, they look everything like what you want, they mm-hmm. act like it, but they just don't really like you enough, essentially. Yeah. yeah, so they're not putting enough. Right. But it is easier to pick that, right? Like, as a guy too I'd consider picking the dream girl that doesn't sacrifice for me yeah yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so I get why you guys are picking that for sure the looks is exactly your type it's got the job rich dude all that Yeah. everything but they're not doing enough yeah Yeah. and honestly I can't do the not enough anymore I can't do it either Yeah. it's so much heartbreak for sure that's what girls pick up until like they get older like 25 ish that's what I'm saying yeah (laughs) 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 But oh. that's <laughs> 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 that Dude, that's literally what girls <laughs> pick, no, it though. Is. It is. It's once you mature that you realize that you need someone who will sacrifice for you. Like, yeah, right. Yeah, yeah. but you. when you're younger, it's all fun and games. Dude, you know, it all makes sense now. What? Also, because as they get older, right, they learn more. Yeah. And that's why they end up, like, sometimes marrying the uglier guys. Yeah. Dude, looks fade. Mm-hmm. Right, 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 yeah. right. But... I'm still in the wrong category right now. 
What you mean? That's okay. You're still young. I'm yeah, still you're figuring the, it out. Like I'm, lo- I'm looking at you for looks and not. <laughs> Honestly, sometimes those are the most fun. <laughs> I know. Yeah. What? They're just I know. Fun. Red flags. <laughs> red flags. I bet they're fun. Flags. <laughs> <laughs> red flags look like six flags. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? It's like you know, one side is so good, but then the other side is so bad. Mm. It balances out yeah. in a way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very like <sighs> roller coaster. Like yeah. the highs are so high, but the lows are. Oh, I know. <laughs> I, I think. Oh, I know, I know, I know. <laughs> she was speechless. <laughs> I think guys stay at that dream type, though. They do. Because, you do, know, yeah. they do. They keep chasing. The guys are like, you know, they like the physical a lot. They do. And guys are supposed to like their girl more than the girl likes them anyway. Right, right, right. So, mm-hmm. might as well have your dream type. Mm-hmm. Jason. Or, okay, go. Oh, I was just going to ask. Yeah. As a guy, how much do you think guys look into, like, the looks, actually? Like, if you had to break it down into a percentage. It's number one. Ooh. If it's strictly looks and personality. Yeah, strictly looks and personality. 70-30. 70-30. Are you guys shocked by that number? I'm shocked. I think that's kind of accurate, shocked. though. Wait, it's pretty really? accurate. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I think that's pretty accurate. Damn. Yeah. And I feel like for girls, it's like... Yeah, what is it for girls? 50-50. For 50-50. 50-50. 50-50. 50-50. 50-50. 50-50. 50-50. 50-50. 50-50. Depending yeah. on what you're looking for at the time. They, <laughs> I feel like, I feel yeah, like yeah. personality might even matter more to girls. Honestly? Yeah. yeah. Dude, yeah, yeah, because if a guy's ugly, but he is really in love with you, you'll find something you like about him. Yeah. Yeah, you'll be like, wait, he's like kind of cute when he mm-hmm. smiles. <laughs> <laughs> but like not too much. You know? Do you think guys are more delusional or girls are more delusional? <laughs> Dude, girls are girls delulu. are delulu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dude, a guy yeah. will look at a girl and he's like, oh, he he wants to fuck me. You know? <laughs> 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 wait, you're saying a guy yeah, will look at a girl? Yeah, no. like a guy will look at you uh-huh. and then you'll be like, oh, he wants me so bad. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, he fucking wants me. Like, Bro, is it actually like that? Oh my God, yeah, sometimes it is. Yeah, I feel like you guys are overthinking shit. Sometimes, yeah. probably. I think it's overconfidence. I think girls have a bad habit uh-huh. of reading too much into guys' actions when it's not that deep. Oh, I feel like yeah. guys do things just like on a whim. They don't right. even really think much about it. Uh-huh. But girls are like, oh, he did that he did because, that because, of, because this. of this. Yeah, yeah. Because, <laughs> because he like, um, oh my God, couldn't sleep or something. You know what I mean? Like yeah. something yeah. deeper when it's really not that yeah. deep. And I feel like when it's like a girl talking about a guy, mm-hmm. like the girls will like always not try to hurt their feelings as much as possible, but the guys are more straight up about it. So let's say like he's not responding to your text. The girls are all exactly. like, he's sleeping. Yeah, don't worry. He's, he's like sleeping or like exactly. he's probably in class or something. Like don't think about it. Uh-huh. And the guys are going to be like, she don't fuck with you or be like super <laughs> straight up. About it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Girls are so nice to each other. Like which, really nice to each other. Which way do you think is the best way to handle that though? Mm-hmm. I want to hear the he's sleeping. <laughs> I hear really, yeah. dude? I feel like I'm the honest friend. I'm yeah, like, girl, he right. don't fuck with you. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I think you need to hear that. No, yeah, for I sure. do need to hear it, <laughs> dude. But that's honestly kind of mean, and sometimes it does make you look like a hater. Like when you're like, oh, he doesn't fuck with you. Yeah, it kind of makes you look like. But in the hate. guy world, that's uh-huh. normal. That, it that's is the crazy part. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's so that's, how, that's how we talk to each other. I yeah. also just don't talk about it because I don't want to know. I'm so like, ignorance is bliss. That means you do kind of know, but you just don't want to hear the yeah, answer. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> no, that's really what it is. You're I don't need to put it into words. I, you know, I didn't hear it. <laughs> You're just ignoring it, basically. Pretty much. <laughs> it's worked for me. <laughs> Do you have another question or do you have one? Oh, you ask one. Okay. Okay, I have a question. Uh Uh-huh. Do you think a relationship can last if it has a rocky start? A rocky start? I will say no, because a good house has to be built on a good foundation. (laughs) (laughs) I've heard that somewhere before. Exactly. Fuck. A stable house needs a stable foundation. So it has to be like perfect in the not perfect but like but good um like equal amounts of attraction the intentions have to be correct mm. i'm trying to think about it what do you think jason i think uh also what is rocky <laughs> like it's like it you guys started off with like like playing games and shit. it was playing games like you guys were just like friends with benefits for a while and then it like kind of oh into that's rocky like i feel like that's rocky. oh yeah, I feel that, like yeah i'm i'm talking about a perfect relationship happens when you guys both equally like each other from the beginning and then it just flourishes into a beautiful yeah. relationship 
when I think of a, when I think of Rocky, I think of like lacking trust mm. in one another, mm-hmm. and I don't think you can do that. Oh yeah, for yeah. sure not. The trust is the biggest yeah. thing I think. I think it's it just lead to more fights, right? Exactly. But if it was just like playing games and it took yeah. a while to get in a relationship, uh-huh. you know that's cool. Wait, what if it was just arguments? Because I feel like arguments are odd in the beginning stages as well. Dude, yeah, yeah. it should be the happiest stage in the yeah. beginning. No, I for feel real. like you should have any arguments at all. No, I agree, low key. Like, no yeah. arguments. So are you saying if you have a couple arguments? Yeah, I think you should I be weary so. of Break something. up? No, I think Don't get it started? Yeah, maybe don't get it started. I wouldn't get it started either. Because I feel like, how? what are you fighting about? Right, that right. At that you, stage? You guys barely know each other. That, do you know what I mean? That's my thing. It's like at that point, if you're arguing, you just don't, you just aren't meant for each other, bro. Really, real. really. I think yeah. shit just doesn't, you guys don't agree or you guys don't match. Yeah. Yeah. I also believe that if you want your relationship to last, you can't break up at all within the first year. Mm. You have to oh, be yeah. one year strong. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah dude. If sure. you can't date them for a year, it's like, then yeah, it's yeah, not yeah. No, none of that break shit. Yeah. Yeah. Break yeah. Shit. <laughs> yeah. Dude, the yeah. break stuff's crazy. Dude, you guys, I've never had that long of a relationship. I don't know why. Really? What's your year longest? plus? A year plus, two years is my longest. Uh huh. Okay. I can't keep a man for some reason. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Wait, two years is a, is a respectable amount is of time. It is. It, it is. is. Yeah. Mine, mine oh, okay. was yeah. only a year and a half. Sure. Really? Yeah. Wait, dude. is it because like some of your homies are in like long ass relationships now? Yeah, that's now? why I'm like, what's going on here? But am, I I the, am I the problem? No. <laughs> I, I think no, no, no. I think like what you went like the path that you are going on is fine. Because you, like, now know, like, you're not going to deal with other bullshit. You went yeah. through the bullshit, so you know That's which true. ones you're not going to mm. deal with. That's but true. people that are in super Very long, true. like, four or five relationships this early into the year, they're just staying because they're probably comfortable. Or they're going to actually get married. Right, right, right. You know? Wait, going back to the argument shit, though. Uh-huh. So, with the, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> thinking about yeah, it, Because yeah, huh? so, you guys said <laughs> that you guys said that somehow, if you know, if you have arguments at the start, you shouldn't start the yeah, relationship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like with the girl I'm talking to right now, like we actually had a couple arguments. That but that's because of this. Yeah, wasn't it? Because of like it I was mean, it was because of the Jake and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah I mean, yeah, yeah. That, also that's cool. Like, that's I understandable. Mean, I, mean, <laughs> okay, I think. Okay. That's just like different because it's like social media. Yeah. And it's but not personality differences. It's oh, okay, not, okay. It's just it's like, just yo, like yo, my, what are you my doing? actions. Yeah, it's just like, what are you doing, bro? <laughs> it's you. Yeah, it's literally, it's that literally was just you, bro. Yeah, that's my fault. Yeah, bro. yeah, yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. I had another question. We got another question? All right. Oh, I have not, it's not really a question, but it's more of a realization that I made. Remember okay. how last time we were talking about being flirty and friendly? Right. Okay, I figured it out. So if like <laughs> we're, at a, to hear this. we're at a party and like I vibe with you, but I'm not really like attracted to you. I'm just like cool. I am so confident. I am hundred percent myself. I am so real. Like I'm just like me completely. If I'm just like whatever about you, but then if I actually like you and like I am attracted to you, I'm a lot more shy. Mm-hmm. I'm more careful with my words and I'm more mean. <laughs> really so it's like me coming off like super friendly from the beginning acting 100% myself I don't really like fuck with you like that you know what I, mean? <laughs> I, I feel like this that. is like a girl thing no it is right um, when I was like younger in college if I really liked a guy at a party I would ignore him no I would ignore him what too. is up with I would that? like barely <laughs> talk to <laughs> him but I would be watching his every move no same oh yeah. really and but you just wait for him while acting like I don't care you know what yeah, I mean yeah 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 it's like the I don't care thing playing hard yeah. but yeah. then like if let's say like you're a guy that's kind of shy and like oh quiet my oh my god I will talk your ear off I love me some shy boys no me too <laughs> interesting i love guys who look like they never talk to a girl I know. <laughs> <laughs> that will get me going no it's it's a thing no i think it's that is a thing though girl Ye- thing no nah, it is like like you're so confident like you're 100 percent yourself when you're talking to a guy that you don't really like hmm. it's interesting that it's like that and i'm very clean <laughs> and how is I'm the guy clingy. and how is the guy supposed to know if you're normally talkative or you're or you're normally silent Oh. Yeah, you don't know. Yeah, honestly. Yeah. Oh, so you just got to figure it's, it out. It's pretty hard with girls, I feel like. <laughs> you know, if I never knew you, because you're pretty social, mm-hmm. and if I never knew you and I met you at a party, mm-hmm. and you're being social, yeah. <laughs> like, that's just you. I know, but I'm, if I, like, am, a, am immediately attracted to you, and I want to, like, I'm, like, I'm, like, I want, I think you're cute. Right. Then, like, it's going to take me a lot more to, like, talk to you. And I'm not going to talk to you a lot and I'm not going to be clingy. Mm, like, but I'm what very if, clingy what if I didn't know you and I met you and you're actually just a shy girl and you're, and you're being shy because you <laughs> like me? How am I supposed to know? You know what I'm saying? 
What if you're just a shy girl? Because there's hella shy girls. Yeah, yeah. I feel like she just had a realization, but she's not even like, she's not like Wait. saying like guys should do this. Oh, are you are you saying like what's how do you tell the difference? Because yeah, you're yeah, kind of yeah, yeah. mixing up the what the guys would think. Because they'll just think that exactly. every shy girl no, no, is no. into them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, that's true. But I'm just saying like for you personally. For just me you personally, personally yeah, yeah. yeah. A lot of girls. If you meet personally. Megan, yeah, yeah. <laughs> if you meet Megan at a party, oh, just know. This is a PSA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If she's okay. shy, yeah, shoot that shot. Yeah, yeah, it's not for every it's girl. Yes, <laughs> there's actually shy no, girls. No, but maybe. it's a thing with girls that they're more confident mm. and more themselves with the guy they're not as interested in. Like, no, I think that is a thing. Yeah, though. no, it is no, a I've thing. I've seen that. I'd yeah. be telling my best fucking jokes to the nerds. No, to the, uh, yeah, and then they, they start giggling. fucking with you. Dude, yeah, they yeah. giggling out their jaws. <laughs> <dude>. <laughs> yeah, because they ain't no pressure. For real, yeah, they ain't no yeah, pressure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm, I, like, I'm so clingy and. Yo, like, that, like, think about. Yeah. I've seen her do that a lot, <laughs> a couple times, bro. It's actually hilarious, bro. Yeah, it's <laughs> <laughs> and but those nerdy guys they'll start liking her might yeah might start liking you oh, yeah, i feel like that kind of yeah they happens. always do but they always like, do it. Like they might even take friends, it the wrong yeah. way like why is she telling so many jokes to me you know yeah. i'm a comedian what can i say <laughs> <laughs> what can i say no but that is also kind of annoying what it is like, annoying when they take it too far yeah <laughs> <laughs> Dude, it's just like <laughs> it's just a weird balance. Yeah, there's no answer to this as a there guy. Really though, is, there really is. Really just, is. You have to get lucky, and she has to like you back. Dude, I think yeah. guys should always pursue though, and then you'll know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And once yeah, you yeah, pursue, yeah. you'll know. I got a question for everyone. What's should up? you unfollow all of your old hookups if you get into a new relationship? Ooh. Jason that's a good. That, that's a good ass question. You like that one, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. What's your guys' answer to that? I personally haven't, but uh-huh. it's not. If they asked me to, I would. But they never asked me, so yeah. I didn't. Okay. So if they asked, though, is that understandable? Yeah. yeah. It's understandable. But really? I feel like I feel like low-key, everyone kind of still, like, wants to check up on their life. <laughs> like, you, you still want to check up on your ex's life. Time how, to time. How they're doing. Right, you know? right, right, like right. You're not going to unfollow them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, because me, personally, I feel like if my girl hit me with, like, a, yo, that girl you hooked up with four years ago, you got to unfollow her. Okay. Four years ago? Like, are you serious, bro? Wait, really? Like, it's not even that... I mean, I would do it, but it's just like, well, are you serious, bro? It's not even that deep. I don't know. Yeah, I've never had a girl tell me to unfall somebody. Yeah, me so neither, me neither. I think I have to experience it. So I, right, right, right. But, uh... I yeah, maybe if it was an ex, either. I would do it. Yeah, I would do it. I no would matter do it. like how long ago. But not it was. an ex, though. Old hookup. Like an old situation. Like a what? Oh, situation? Yeah, you guys yeah. fucked twice. Oh. You guys talked for a month. Dude, right. I feel like those are low key more dangerous than exes. That is true, though. Yeah. <laughs> those because ones creep back always, in the picture. They always come back. <laughs> yeah. Their story isn't finished, you know? Nah, for real. Yeah, but ex, you kind of have a clean break. Like, right. I mean, that's mm-hmm. that. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. So, so the situation shifts, like, dangy. you would understand. It's dangy. Do you guys, like, ask your partner, like, who your exes are? Like, all of them? The most recent ex. Yeah, most recent. And then if and you're then if, if, if you're kind of like, in the same friend group, like you'll know their exes. True, true, true. What do you mean? Like you can you can you have mutuals. Like you can ask. Like yeah. oh, you, you kind of know like who mm-hmm. he dated in the past. It's not right. like hard to know. Oh, so you wouldn't ask her directly to tell you? No, I would ask about the recent ex. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I would not ask about hookups though. Yeah, me neither. Hookups, bro. I'd yeah. rather not know. Yeah. I'd rather same. not know either. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to know anything. All right. Well, switching lanes completely. I got a different question. If you guys woke up as the opposite gender, what's the first thing you would do? Ooh. What's the first thing you would do, Jason? I'd get my dick sucked. Oh, <laughs> top tier answer. That's I'd a great be, answer. Yeah, Who I'd you get your dick sucked by? Me. What? <laughs> <laughs> you can't, bro. <laughs> what? The, if the option uh, was there, a girl though. girl like me. <laughs> yeah. I would, I would go fuck somebody. Actually, it's, Megan. Hey, you go... Megan, <laughs> I'll, I'll suck your dick for yeah, you. Yeah, no, I want to. Yo, I want to you, know, you know how weird that versa? is, bro. Yeah, of course, I'll yeah. do it. Hey, you know yo, how weird that is, that's bro. That's crazy. <laughs> you gotta give me that neck. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! That's no, insane. Yeah, I'm gonna do it for you. Dude, no, I've wow. always, I've always wondered what it felt like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because yeah. guys just go they crazy eat that shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You guys gotta experience that one if you did switch. But as a girl, dude, I don't know what I would do. I was thinking about it. Let the homies hit. No! <laughs> that's, that's insane. That's, 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 that's insane. That's insane. Oh, that's weird, though. Oh, that's weird, but you're going to let Megan suck your dick. <laughs> no, I just said it's the same thing. 
thing. It's the same thing. That's literally let your homie hit. This is what is happening. Yeah, I mean, I guess. How would you like walk Paul into would be the one like I would it. not want to hit a girl, <laughs> Jason, bro. I'm not <laughs> hitting that. Not hitting that. No. Well, bro, you got it. Like, like, <laughs> you got to realize, like, if I woke up as a girl, obviously I wouldn't be me anymore. Yeah, I would, you know, I would be like a pretty girl now. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? That is true. <laughs> Fuck, I don't know. For me though, I was gonna say if I had to think of something, I think I just want to walk outside and try to flirt with as many guys as I could, just to see how it feels to be that wanted. Oh, I would walk. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I that's a good one. Because mm-hmm. girls what? can't do that. You know what? You guys, if you guys were ever turned into a guy, you should go to a bar uh-huh. and try to hit on girls. Oh, my God. See how yes. fucking hard that shit is. <laughs> For <laughs> real. hard that shit is, bro. For real. I, yeah, I don't Y'all think need it would be that hard. I don't think it would be that hard. Oh, bro, come on. This is that girl mentality. Yeah, this, bro. Bro. Go to a club. Go to a club and see how hard that shit I is. I got you. Pay for your drinks. Dude, yeah. Whip out the card for the first time ever. Yeah, bro. <laughs> And talk to these mean girls out here, bro. <laughs> Get rejected. I promise you, you won't even be able to take it. <laughs> whatever. I'm getting my dick struck. So. Yeah. yeah. Whatever. <laughs> I'm getting hit by Megan, so I don't really care. If I get rejected by some girl at the club. Nah, I feel you. I feel you on that. <laughs> All right. I got a funny... Wait. wait. Oh, right, Who do you think would be prettier girl, Paul or Jason? <laughs> bro. Dude, I, I'm skinnier than Jason. So? Ja- Jason will be a big body. <laughs> Jason will be a big, like he's got a big chest, though. No, he got, Jason, he's got bigger no, titties. Jason would be, like, thick. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Jason would but be, like, IG a really thick. Ice spice. Ice spice. <laughs> like, a really, like, five foot, like, Dude. Asian ABG girl. Yeah, but Paul's giving With, like, more, big like, titties. more, like, Kendall Jenner vibe. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I like that one. I like that one. <laughs> okay. Are we turning into a random girl or are we turning into the girl version of girl us? Girl versions of yourself. Dude, I look you feel Jason like might be I a cutie now that I think about <laughs> it. Actually, no, yeah. I'd be ABG. You'd have that dragon yeah. tattoo on the uh, back. Yeah, I had everything. everything. Yeah, down my hair. spine, down my spine. Lashes, that, nails. Yeah, that balayage. You, you might be cute, bro. Balayage. <laughs> I'll get the fake yitties, the fucking nails, everything. I don't think you need Yeah, I think you'd have natural yitties, bro. No, yeah, no, Jason. Yeah, you got some yitties, bro. Yeah, I got that bunta. I got everything, Dude, I look you feel like if I was a guy, I would spit game. Like, really? Yeah. Really? You, you'd probably be pretty tall. Exactly. I think yeah. if I was a guy, I'd Dude, be really I'd sporty. Be a tall Asian sporty. Guy. Yeah, yeah. You, yeah. No, no, no. Her brother is like 6'2", six, 6'3". Six, oh, my three. God. Yeah, you'd be tall then, bro. What's up? <laughs> What's up, Shadi? I, I feel like I'd play basketball. Really? If I was a guy. Or I'd be like a sporty vibe. Okay. She would be well, like... Skater boy vibe. An athlete. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, I, I like can see the skater boy like a surfer. Boy yeah. Surfer, boy. surfer, skater boy. Yeah. No, Ooh, I could I like see that, that for sure. Mm-hmm. You think you could actually pull girls as a guy? Oh, yeah. I know I can. I would love for them to try one day, bro. Yeah. I wish we could run a video. Like I honestly, I, I believe Jennifer could. Yeah. yeah. I don't know about Megan, though. Yeah, I only speak game like that. <laughs> <laughs> it comes to you. It comes to you. It comes to you. <laughs> Are <laughs> right, you guys ready? You for know me? what I would say? No. <laughs> you had a name, or can I call you mine? <laughs> oh <laughs> no! And then the girl walks away. She'll slap you and walk away. No. <laughs> She'll slap you, bro. She'll be like, "What the She'll fuck?" Don't you me? <laughs> yeah. No. No security. You, know, you gotta realize some of the shit you say only works because you're a girl. Oh, for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, like, oh my god, when we were at Nurko, I was like standing by myself, uh-huh. and like it was just me in the security line, and I was just fucking eyeing the security guard, and huh? I was like giving him like pouty eyes, and he let me through. Oh. oh, so you gave him the fuck me eyes. No, not the <laughs> another fuck me. example of, like the how, of the benefits of being a girl at a club. <laughs> <laughs> another That's prime like, example. Honestly, yeah, like we wouldn't really make it out as a guy at a club. So stay safe. I love being stay a girl, safe. though. You gotta pay for every ticket to the club, every drink. You gotta Dude. pay for two drinks because you gotta yeah, try yeah, to impress two. a girl. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You gotta get rejected by four girls before you meet <laughs> the one girl that'll give right. you a chance. Right, right, right. You right, know right, what I'm saying? Right, right. Yeah. Collect a couple Instagrams, you know. <laughs> Yeah, I don't even shoot my shot at all anymore. I just so nothing. Just nothing. So nothing. Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just. I'm, I'm in my healing. Nah, you guys I'm living in that good life. Area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm in my healing era. Same. My phone be dry as fuck. 
Same. Not gonna lie. No, my phone. <laughs> you guys are asking to get DM'd right now. Yeah, what yeah. is going on, bro? The no, crazy the, thing the thing is, is I don't want it. The crazy thing is, they won't respond. But <laughs> no, I know. Accept it, though. I know. Accept it, yeah. I know. That's the craziest part of it. <laughs> Are right, y'all ready for the next question? Yeah. yeah. All right, this is for the girls strictly kind of goofy and shit, right? But say you're about to go down on a guy, give him some mean top, right? Yeah. <laughs> Pull down his shorts, uh-huh. and he's got some crazy underwear, like SpongeBob Ooh, underwear. Yeah. Does it turn you off at all? Like, does the underwear matter? It depends on the guy. It if does. I really like you, I would think it's super funny, super cute. Yeah. I'll go down on you, give you a great head. Really? But if you're like, whatever, <laughs> put that shit back up. Well, like, you're really? already, you're down to give him some head already. So you find him somewhat attractive. But say you pull it down some okay. tidy whities Well, okay. If it's like a goofy ass guy, uh-huh. then I think it's funny. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's, serious, it's gotta dude. fit your vibe. Yeah, it's gotta fit your vibe. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But if it's some like <laughs> pull the SpongeBob yeah, yeah, yeah. laughing at you, like you gotta fit the SpongeBob vibe. Exactly. Like, okay. Exactly. <laughs> oh, really? Mm-hmm, yeah, mm-hmm. but if it's like a real serious dude, and then you pull it down, right? And it's like SpongeBob. It's like Captain Underpants. <laughs> What's going okay, on? Okay, but you gotta be for real though. Like yeah, you guys yeah. are already in bed. Right, right, like, right. Like you're probably already naked. Yeah. Like, are you really pulling that shit back up and then leaving? That's true. If I already decided that, I'll do it regardless of what it is. Really? Yeah. No, I can walk out. Yeah, because I think like potentially. Out. I've, I've. There's been situations where I'm like, okay, I don't want to do it, and then I'll like switch it somehow. Oh really? Oh, like you'll see something wrong. Yeah. Exa- example. Example. <laughs> No, I don't want to say that. Wait, Megan, do you prefer seeing boxers or briefs? <laughs> she means briefs like the skin briefs tight. Briefs, this is the skin. Oh, yeah, briefs. Yeah. Yeah. I low key like the skin tight ones. Really? Yeah, better than boxers. I like boxers. I feel like boxers is a little childish. <laughs> Actually, I'm a huge brief you, guy. You're talking about like no. the plaid boxes. No, yeah, yeah, yeah. The classic. Like the plaid. red. The no, red right. I like the briefs. Right? I like the black briefs. <laughs> the black briefs. Okay, but there's cool Calvin boxes Klein. though. There's yeah, there's cool. Yeah, yeah. The CKs cool bo- are classic. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking about like the Ethicas, bro. You know how they have all sorts of weird designs on it these days, bro. Like you pull it down, you actually might see who knows what down there. And I feel like it could turn Wait, off the girl. You guys, you guys are not weirded out that it's like almost too tight. No, I like the tighter the better. No, no. Uh, yeah. If a guy is wearing like a compression shirt, that's just oh my god. No. Yeah, yeah, the shirt. Tight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The shirt is cool. I love tight clothes on guys. Oh, oh no, okay. not, no, no. Okay, oh, not, not like for skin pants. Tight. Skin yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like oh, like even like like the jeans, bro. <laughs> <laughs> the jeans, bro. Oh hell no, no, no. The jeans. No. Bro. The jeans, bro. Not the jeans. No. The jeans. Not the jeans. The like shorts, shirts. bro. <laughs> I like tight shirts. I like oh, okay. I like tight shirts too, but right. I also really like guys that wear like clothes that are too big for them. Oh yeah. Mm. I love the baggy pants. Yeah, I okay. love yeah. baggy pants. Like baggy very pants. So very really small, tight. Too big. Yeah, yeah. Really tight or really big. <laughs> the top tight, the bottom loose. Loose. Mm. Yeah. Like if you wear a compression shirt. Bro, I'll eat that shit up. Dude, like that's literally so hot. But you gotta be in shape. No, yeah, you gotta yeah, be in shape. Yeah, Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, also, um, I realized that a lot of guys, you put on like a black t shirt and some cargo pants, and he's like the most fashionable guy in the world. <laughs> no, dead ass. But cargo pants. Yeah. yeah, but girls, if we wore that shit, like you, you're a bum. Like you're an Adam Sandler <laughs> looking. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No, not even, bro. Dude, girls, <laughs> I don't know who brought it, Adam Sandler. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, sorry, Adam. Yeah, put <laughs> it on Adam. I know he I caught like a stray. I like looking like Adam. <laughs> 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 you know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah I guess. Our hair, our nails, oh, our eyelashes. True. Like, I feel like girls are more hustlers than guys. Yeah. Because we have to build up that money to maintain ourselves. Being a girl <sighs> is harder. Yeah, the maintenance is mm-hmm. insane. Although the perks are great, being a girl is harder. You know what I mean? I agree with that. Dude, and yeah. you I only agree get with the that. perks if you're well kept. Like, well kept, yeah. yeah. Like, you're not going to give a free drink to a bum-ass girl at a club. Exactly. Right, you know right, I mean? right, exactly. yeah. right, right. So there's some <laughs> trade there. That pretty. But I mean, like, guys are well kept, too. It's not like we're not trying our best out here. I know, That's but true. you guys can get away with using three-in-one shampoos. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Oh, but girls can't. Girls can't. Uh, yeah, yeah, that is true. That you know what I mean? True, like, actually. girls have to a sp- conditioner, they shampoo, do, they do. body wash, hair masks, you know? No, I agree. You guys use one soap bar to <laughs> clean everything. No, bro. <laughs> it's just guys but have more leeway with it. Like yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. There's no, more leeway. There's more leeway. Definitely, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
Isn't it crazy how we have a soap for everything? Like dish <laughs> soap, insane. hand soap, hair soap, laundry soap, laundry soap. Everything is just soap in different Car colors. Soap. All right. Well, I got another question for y'all. Um, for the girls, is it like embarrassing if a guy DMs you and then you don't respond, right? And then he deletes it like a month later. Oh, I hate that. Why? Because you got to do it with your chest. If you're going to do it, just do it. Oh. I hear a lot of girls hating on guys who delete their DMs, right? Yeah, because that's a pussy move. Okay, but you didn't fucking respond. So why the fuck should I even leave it there? That I is, that is true. <laughs> I, yeah. no, I honestly don't care. Really? I mean, yeah. Because you guys get that notification that they deleted it. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah. you get a notification. Yeah. Dude, but they, if it's a month later, you're not going to know which one it was. True, true, yeah. true, true. Yeah. You're going to forget. Yeah, Honestly, forget. if like you sent out a DM and a girl didn't respond mm -hmm. in like a week, she probably forgot it. The, I think it happens. Our guys <laughs> do it because they don't want to get screenshotted later. Or yeah. something. Yeah. yeah no yeah, proof. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I would just be like, oh, he's still thinking about me. <laughs> he went back to delete it. <laughs> Wait, so it's not embarrassing though, you're saying? Or kind of is. I will keep that in mind. Yeah, yeah, if yeah. If I ever see you. Yeah. Nah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> nah. Like you see him in person, like you're the motherfucker that deleted <laughs> right, right. his yeah, DM. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Fuck. But it's not a big deal, honestly. Okay. I see what I see the guy's side. Right. Yeah, because you don't want to keep that in her inbox. Right. Yeah. But it gets hated on a lot, dude. I was like, yo, what the fuck, bro? Deleting. Yeah, it's yeah. kind of like it is a pussy, like kind of. It is. It yeah. Is. They yeah. say yeah. with your chest or whatever. I also mm -hmm. understand that guys want to move on from that. <laughs> they don't want to have because imagine you <laughs> saw the guy he, that dm'd you in person you'll go to your friend like yo he dm'd me back in the day yeah. Yeah. and you'll yeah, show that dm exactly yeah, but if he deleted it then you wouldn't show nothing yeah. exactly yeah, sure. exactly yeah. bro it's all just word exactly bro <laughs> at that point you're, you're right <laughs> all right well keeping the pushing i got <laughs> another question for y'all all right say you're about to go down on a girl or you're about to get to business <laughs> okay. when is the right time to ask her if she's on birth control Ooh. because you gotta know what do you mean if you need a if you need a condom or yeah. not, right so right when before, do you ask her right before you are about to have um sexual intercourse yeah but it's post um what is that when you start getting heated foreplay foreplay uh -huh. post foreplay pre Pre-insert. Pre-insert. Pre yeah. And then yeah, if yeah, you yeah. don't have it, you got to go run and get the condom. Go run you and go get run. it. Go run. Go run. Really? Honestly, that shit is so <laughs> icky. I just, I, I, I just like close my eyes. Wait, what's so icky? Like, what then we're like, running away to go. Oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. You still <laughs> <like running. laughs> <laughs> 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 uh, You feel like the little butt? <laughs> no, I know. I can literally imagine it, it happened one time. I, I literally just turned around. <laughs> 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 like, Bro, what is what oh is so God. wrong about that? No, I, I feel like it takes a, a second for me to like get used to like a guy's butt cheek or something, dude. Yeah. Like, <laughs> seeing a guy naked is so weird. It's really? So really? Weird. It is it's weird, so especially because like, their thighs are always so fucking white. They all, yeah. <laughs> no dead ass, and, and they always oh. have a sock tan too. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> and like, oh my god, and their butt is so white. So dude. white. So white. <laughs> Honestly, so guys are not trying to show their ass. Yeah, definitely Dude, not. We'll also, walk with our with the cock side that way. <laughs> <laughs> like we'll walk like cock we'll, side we'll is back track. We'll oh. back track with it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Bro, yeah, yeah, yeah. That yeah. shit's hilarious. Dude, yeah. And also, whenever they do that little run, the butt tenses up like, so geez. much. It's like so tight. <laughs> it's always so it tight. It is, dude. Oh, fuck. Oh my god, I can't. I dude, can't. guys Dude. low key have like a really tight butt always. Yeah. It's yeah. Very yeah. firm. Yeah. Right. Because nice. yeah. most nice guys like work out and it's not fat like girls. It's muscle. Yeah. 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 So it's not even, they can't even, they're not even flexing. Like that's just that's their just butt. Their no, for real. No, but I feel like guys have nice butts. Yeah, they Shapely do. Shapely butts. No, yeah. for sure. Yeah. I know a lot of guys with bubble butts. <laughs> I know. Yeah. <laughs> that's yeah. crazy that we're talking about guys' asses <laughs> right now. No, <laughs> but, but going back to your question, you said, when is the right time to ask if she's on birth control? Okay, so for me, yeah. I wouldn't recommend this. Uh -huh. It's literally like 10 seconds before I buzz. Because if I'm asking if I could come inside or not. Right, <laughs> right, 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 right. Dead ass, bro. Fuck. Dead ass, bro. That's, that's my I move. <laughs> <laughs> he also doesn't rap it, so that's the difference. You know what I mean? Like, bro, if, you the, if, the girl, <laughs> if the girl doesn't say anything, uh -huh. I'm going in. Really? I'm going in the deep end. Are you serious? Yes, bro. Oh my, yes, I would bro. be so mad at you. 
What do you mean? Wait, wait, wait. you have wait, to you ask. Just, yeah, if the yeah. girl doesn't say anything. No, I'm saying I'm saying without a condom. Yeah, I'm saying I'm, I'm going in without a condom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. If the girl and don't say anything. It's like the first time. I'm not going to ask. No, I know. <laughs> you're, you're just going to like bust in her? No, and then, like I said, oh, like 10 this? seconds <laughs> before, I need to know if I need to pull oh. out or not. So I'm like, yo, are you on BC real quick in her ear? Oh. Yeah. I mean, yeah, I, I understand. That works for yeah. sure. Like, that's chill. I don't. I wouldn't want to hear that. Yeah, I wouldn't. Oh, I, really? I would be low key like so. Dude, because even if I was what? on birth control, yeah. I wouldn't let a guy a nut guy. in me. Exactly. Oh, really? really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I don't want you whispering that in my ear, mid stroke. Oh, really? It has <laughs> to be like, <laughs> what's, what's wrong? Yeah, what's wrong with that? Like, I'm not saying it all weird. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! Like, I'll, I'll say it. I'll say it nicely. I'm not saying it weirdly. I can't even imagine that nicely. Damn, for real. Me? It's like that, huh? Can you imagine it nicely, Jennifer? Um, like how do you word it? Yeah, can you just just do it? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, are you like birth control? No, <laughs> that? no I'd be like, fuck. <laughs> Yo! Don't start with the oh my god. No, like bro. imagine like I'm in your ear, like soft spoken and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd be like, Oh, you want I'd birth like, control? No, I'd be like, fuck, are you on birth control? Mm. You know what I'm saying? I yeah, I know Jason trying yeah, to be his sexy know, and shit. What are you doing? That? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh. You know what I'm saying? Um. And then wouldn't you get turned on? Cause you're like, oh, like it's game time. Like he wants to, mm. you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I see. The I've gotten a couple girls like that, bro. I'm not <laughs> Okay, I can see it like either way, but like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> not really. Damn. <laughs> but Wait, my f- first initial reaction isn't like great. You know what I mean? Hmm. I don't know. I mean, I've never been asked that. I see. Either. Wait, I'll I take it the totally different way though. This question. What? Like, I'll saying it like, cause I've seen online girls would say it's disrespectful if they ask that too early, cause it's kind of insinuating like, oh, you're guaranteed think we're fucking like. No, this has yeah, to be yeah. when, when you're. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That is true. It is disrespectful. Yeah, really? it is disrespectful if you ask like during the date or some yeah, shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah. weird as fuck. I would, I would ask her over text the day before. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like back in the day. Bro, that's bro. weird. Dead ass, bro. Yeah, don't that's do that. weird. Oh Why are you God. asking that over text? It was like, it was like we already know we're fucking. Oh. We already know. Like, like you already. So I just get it out the way. Like yo, like. No, I feel like that's always. Do you know? Do you know? Yeah. Exactly. Oh, for sure. Like, how do you know? When I'm about to fuck. Yeah. yeah. When she's about, to, she's like, okay, yeah, you could pick me up at two a.m. tomorrow. Oh. Like we discuss. Like yeah. Right. Be, right. Yeah. Oh, you're dirty. <laughs> <laughs> you're dirty. So she would say me. like, yo, pick me up tomorrow at two a.m. And yeah, then you yeah, would yeah. hit. You would hit her with. Not like right a, away. Obviously, like I genuinely know her fucking bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. I'm saying like you would hear that and be like, "Oh, by the way, yeah, yeah. By the way, are you on BC? Yeah, yeah. Or should I buy a condom? Oh, Uh, I guess uh, I don't know. Is that rude though? I'm asking. I'm asking. Girl, shit. Yeah, I should probably have never done that, right? No, you should ask in person. (laughs) Okay, okay. Yeah, but that like he might need to buy a rubber. Like that's the that's the reason. Like just always have it. Yeah, maybe just have one. Just always have have it handy. Yeah. Isn't that weird though? Too, I found that so weird. No, no. But is it weirder if a girl has it? A condom? Let's say like you're about to fuck. You know what I mean? She's a freak. Weird if a girl yeah, yeah, has she's a, she a freak. freak. She's a freak. Bro, she, but she a safe freak. Yeah. yeah she's a safe freak. <laughs> <laughs> but honestly, my first thought is like, who else was here? Like, who else was here fucking right, that's right, what right. I would think. in right, your room right. with you? Right. No, for sure. There's like seven left and it's a nine pack. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it's like it's a, what kind of package? No, is seriously. You know seriously. I mean? Dude, how like would you Trojan feel? Or? How would you feel if she had like magnums? magnums. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, would you still? The double XL. Would you try to still put it on? <laughs> that shit's so embarrassing. Yo. <laughs> Yo. Are no, you insinuating that we don't we don't have big <laughs> no. <laughs> no the Magnum XL bro that happened to me once bro dead ass bro that happened dude, to dude you? I swear that shit fits like huge ass thing right <laughs> yeah, dude, yeah, you, yeah 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 you gotta put it on because it's like yo you can't be no bitch you can't put it on and then take it off no no no, no, no. you <laughs> just drag it down a bit what if it slips oh like you, you drag you get the space and then you tuck it to the kind of kind of kind of yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know ah bro that's so what do you do in that situation though the girl. The you, girl's like, you yo. just don't even open it. Oh, yeah. right, right, right. Bro, I'm, it's that. so much more embarrassing if you put it on. <laughs> it's just like hella flappy. And then you <laughs> have to take it off, bro. <laughs> like, no, 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 no for sure. Would sure. you see the XL in the corner? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Shin. For sure. I actually, I don't even know if I could get hard, bro. I'd be like, I'd be like who are you fucking with a big ass dick? Like, I'd like, be like, yo. No, for real, bro. Those are, XLs are huge, dog. Yeah, <laughs> 
<laughs> that's so funny it's like though. a 10 yeah i don't know anyone yeah girls I'm just don't don't seat. have rubbers at your house i've never actually yeah i don't ever want to have one yeah i think automatically all guys are gonna think you're a hoe I, mean, I also don't, don't like rubbers. Wait, this either. is a side question. Oh, we didn't even think. Wait, is it weird if a guy has a condom, though? It's not weird. No, In his it's wallet? Not weird. No, I feel like it's a lot what? better. Dude, that's so normal. No, it's so normal. Really? Yeah. I thought it's yeah. like kind of joked. Like, if I see my guy, homie, mm-hmm. we're, we're chilling, just eating don't dinner. Don't keep it in your wallet. No, but say it's in his wallet and I see it, I'm like. <laughs> It is kind of it is kind of jokes. Yeah. And also, like, when you guys, like, pull up to the first date. Yeah. And he, like, just has one in his pocket. <laughs> and you were like, oh, like, you just expected we're going to fuck? Yeah, honestly, like, let's say, like, you are gonna fuck on the first date. Yeah. Like, pretend you don't have it and, like, go get some together. Mm. Wow, you have one in your pocket. Yeah. You go to the CVS. Or, like, be like, oh, I have one in my car. <laughs> or I have one in my car, so pretend to go to your car. Oh, yeah, yeah, You yeah. know what I mean? Dude, but, but sometimes, sometimes when a guy does have it, I will say I get a little, like, upset yeah. about it. Right. I'm like, why do you just have that? You a hoe. Yeah, right. I, I think right. he's a hoe. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Right. But real hoes don't use condoms. I learned that. Real hoes mm-hmm. don't use condoms. Yeah. But don't listen to that, guys. You <laughs> r- r- wrap up, wrap up, wrap up. <laughs> I also have a little rant to have. Oh, oh, let's hear it, let's hear it. Dude, I feel like guys who overly express their hate for hoes uh-huh. are the biggest hoes. Ooh. Yeah. That is 100% right? true. Right? Yeah. That is 100% true. When you're like, oh, true. I would never like... She's such a fucking hoe. Mm-hmm. Yeah, talking about all He's these. He's the random. biggest fucking He's hoe. He's the biggest hoe. And mm. guys who say they hate liars are the biggest liars. Yeah. <laughs> it's it's projecting. It's projecting. It's projecting. Oh yet my again. god, that's that crazy. Is so I've definitely said that a couple true. times. Guys are <laughs> constantly so projecting. True. Yeah. yeah. Guys are constantly. They love projecting. hoes, low key. No, they, they love. <laughs> they do. <laughs> they love. Hoes. Yeah, they just mad. She not with them. You think so? Yeah, like if they if they see a hoe, they're not gonna call their girlfriend a hoe because they got her. Oh, I see what you're saying. It's because they couldn't get her. No, but they do get her. Oh, what? Yeah, but then they say they fucking hate hoes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. No, I, I feel that for it's sure. Project- you know what I'm saying? Yeah, guys I've done the, that a couple times. Guys are the <laughs> biggest <laughs> cappers in this entire world. So cap. All men are liars. It's like, bro, say you you're with some girl, right? Yeah. You just you're kind of, it's like fresh. You're walking around. You see a girl. You hit right. And I tell this girl, I'm like, bro, look at that. That girl's a hoe, bro. Like, I, 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 w- I would say that before. I'm not going to lie. No, I'm not yeah. going to lie. Yeah. No, it's so true. <laughs> but they're saying because you said that, you're a hoe too. Yeah. yeah. And that's so yeah. true. No, it's true. That's so <laughs> true. That's so that's true. true. It's yeah. actually insanely true. Yeah. No, nah, yeah. it is. Anyways, yeah. I don't have any more questions. All right. I got another question for y'all. But um, after the one year mark, what other milestones do you celebrate with your partner? Six months. <laughs> After the one year, yeah, like so you celebrate the eighteenth month, one and a half, yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, Actually, for me, I'll celebrate every month up until the year, uh-huh. and then after that, you can do two years. Really? Yeah. Celebrate every month? every month till the year? No, yeah. I, I was that way too. I the eighth month, the ninth <laughs> month. Yeah, yeah. Oh, the well, tenth I month. would be like, I'd be like, oh, it's seven months. Let's just have dinner. Right. So yeah, do something like small, cute. Right. But like, if it's like a six month mark or a one year mark, no matter how many years, that's a big, big celebration. Right. I'm on that same boat. Mm-hmm. Loki. I celebrated so, the 18th month. So at the three and a half year mark, <coughs> mm-hmm. you're going on a big trip. Hopefully, yeah. bro. Hopefully, <laughs> no, for real, bro. No, I, Yo, I nah, want nah, it. Nah, nah, nah. No, really? I think, I think especially because it was my first girlfriend, bro. Like yeah. I was celebrating every month up to like the 15th month, and eat my girl. Hit what? Me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My girl hit me with like a yo, like. Like, you know, you don't have to do all that, you know, <laughs> like, yeah. like, yeah, yeah, you know, like, it's not like that. It's, you know what I mean? Because she's had boyfriends yeah, before. Yeah. So Wait. she's like, yo, this guy's celebrating every month. God <laughs> damn. Wait, Paul, Paul, uh-huh. like every month you would do something for her? Every like, month. Like second month, third month, fourth every month? Every month. Like, like you what? Like till the 15th month. Like what? Dude, you get I gave a flower every month for like the whole year. Oh, and then, but oh I, would always, I like that. Yeah, I would, I would always want do that. like some shit. Now it's just like dinners. And then eventually like she, after. Uh, she told me she's like you know like you can chill too yeah. you know then i was like okay, okay let's I feel just do like, that every six months yeah, but is yeah. that weird too no i feel like if you're okay so <laughs> the main things i feel like are like one month of you guys dating something cute little tiny uh-huh. six months you do something bigger uh-huh. and then that first one year is your biggest one up into that relationship and then from then on it's just six months Every six months. I'd say every year after the first year. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. But I don't you're think not, you're I don't not doing like a, like a cute dinner for your like 18th month? Uh, I mean, we might already just be going to dinner. Mm-hmm. 
But it won't be anything special, I don't think. Nothing too intentional. Yeah, yeah. Oh, really? Well, On the I 18th I month? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's no, not like that. Yeah, Dang. I want, I want the happy anniversary I like that bullshit shit I like that, that they shit. bring out. Yeah, I love that shit. Me too. Wait, also, do you think it's valid to get angry if a guy forgets, like, your fourth month or fifth month? Oh. Is it valid if the girl gets angry that like I forgot? upset that he forgot that it was their fourth or fifth month. Dude, the fourth month, I'm not doing shit. <laughs> Yeah, I'm but what if you really, you don't even remember it? Like, you don't, no text or nothing, right? Mm-hmm, You're saying? Mm-hmm. Uh, you I would want just a forgot. text. If it was I'm just not, a text, I'd be so I'm happy actually not that. texting. Oh, really? I'm actually not texting, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Like <laughs> yeah, I'm actually not texting. I could understand if she gets mad, but. I don't think she can be mad mad. Oh, really? Yeah. But it, I, I, I understand it if she was like, do you, do you know what today is? You know? Mm, like more casually yeah more casual about it but if like she was mad about it mm-hmm. that's just like I mean that's just your preference on whether or not you want to do it or something true you know wait Jason since you've dated a lot of like Korean Korean girls have you ever celebrated you know like the, the Korean yeah 100 day? day or any of those I feel like you have bro no no no, no? no, no. The, the 22nd day 100 days it was like 3 months some change uh-huh. no I didn't do that no, no. Oh, shit. no. what's the 20 20- too. Koreans celebrate a bunch of like random, random days, ones, right? They, they do the hundreds, hundreds. hundreds don't, like isn't the there like a early one too? Like, like I don't How know. How do you even track that, dude? The Koreans you do are the crazy. Pepe oh, day. The, yeah, they got apps. They got apps for. Yeah, what? Pepe day. What's Pepe day? Oh, Where November you have 11th. To, like it's give. Oh. Yeah, that's Pepe day. You have to like give your girlfriend like a bunch of Pepe. <laughs> oh, that's cute. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> that's cute yup I mean that was the end of this week's episode we're gonna go into the nerf challenge we hope you guys enjoy that alright 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 make sure to like comment and subscribe uh, thank you guys for showing us so much love yes sir yes sir and we're the 9 for 9 podcast baby peace out peace alright what's up guys so we're doing the blindfolded nerf gun challenge basically we're all gonna take a turn we got 5 shots to hit whoever gets the least amount of hits has to take 2 <laughs> shots all right, two shots of Tito's. Yes, sir. Oh. All right, so we're, we have to move every five seconds, and then we stop when Paul shoots his all five Paul bullets. Paul looks so goofy right now. <laughs> <laughs> Paul's ready, Paul's ready. All right, are we yeah. good? Yeah. Well, oh! <laughs> you only get five shots, you only get five shots. Oh. <laughs> Am I pointing straight at the side? Yeah. Alright. Get him, get him, get him. Let me hear yourself. Let me hear yourself. Yo. Make some noise, help him, help him, last one! Alright, let's go! Since none of us hit nobody, we're gonna have three shots each to hit right. that soju bottle. Right, right, right. And the loser has to take a shot. That's yes, what we do. Yes, sir. That's what we do. Oh, you got two more. No, she did. No, she did. Oh, my bad, my bad. Okay, okay. I'm watching. Oh. <laughs> oh. Ah. It's all good. It's all good. Yeah, I do. Oh. Oh, this angle's tough from back here, bro. Ooh. God damn. I didn't get it. No. no. Locked in? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. that was so bad. Oh! 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 Oh
baby. <laughs> Let me know. Let's go. We good. We good? Yeah. Hey, yeah. Paul got in too. She. 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 Oh. No. Yo. Bro. All right, so since Paul won, we're taking a fucking shot of this. Yes, sir. All right, but uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. We are going to take this shot, all right? So don't worry. Like, comment, and subscribe. And we're the 9 for 9 Podcast, baby. Peace out.